beautiful dreamers, it's Nova Rose the Beauty Nerd here and today we are going to be trying out the new Wet n Wild Flights of Fancy box collection. Now this is their, or at least part of their summer 2018 um, collection and it's really cool because uh, a portion of the proceeds, if you buy this collection or if you buy anything, I think, um, or maybe it's just, just for the box, but it goes to help um, hummingbirds and it goes to the Los Angeles Audubon Society, which is awesome because uh, I love hummingbirds. I have a lot of hummingbirds where I live. We put up hummingbird feeders for them. So it's really, really a cool thing. Um, so I got my hands on the box collection, which retails for $34.99. And you also get this really cool um, Wet n Wild Hummingbird pin, which I don't have with me right now because I just pinned it onto one of my jackets. But it's really cute and it's really cool. So this is obviously not the full collection. This is just the box collection in which you get you get the three baked blushes, the three eyeshadow quads, four of the lip glosses, there are five, two of the eyeliners, there are three eyeliners, I believe, the primer water, and one of the lip scrubs. There is another one which is a citrus, I think. It's called Citrus Elixir. And then also there, uh, the collection includes six nail polishes, I believe. So, I mean, this is a lot of stuff, which is really cool, and yeah, um, we're just gonna go through and test these out. So as you can see, I already have my eyebrows done. I'm not gonna be wearing any foundation today. Um, I just wanna let my skin breathe, but I ha do have moisturizer and primer on, like a pore filling primer, and you know, obviously my eyebrows, and my eyes are already primed. So I think we're gonna just test out first the primer spray, just to kind of hopefully set the primer that I already used in. So packaging looks like so. This is what the little nozzle looks like. Let me just give it a test, test spray. Feels pretty nice. Let's try it all over the face. Doesn't smell like much, which is sometimes, you know, pretty much a good thing. Fan my face a little bit. Um, I mean, it feels nice and refreshing. Can't say much more about it because it's just a spray. I think we'll try out the lip scrub next. So this is the Perfect Pout Lip Scrub, and this is in Pecker Up. And I think from the packaging, it's supposed to be watermelon. So you open it up, you got this little cover. Smells, <laughs> smells like watermelon. So we're gonna just take a little bit and scrub our lips. I mean, it smells like the lip scrub. Can you eat this? I think you can. Okay, so I forgot to tell you what these retail for separately. So box retails for $34.99. The, pout, uh, the lip scrubs retail for $3.99 each, and the primer water retails for $4.99. This is all in American dollars, if you're wondering. So, lip scrub, I mean, my lips feel, you know, somewhat exfoliated, um, which is great. So now we're gonna move on to the eyeshadow quads. So here are the eyeshadow quads. They retail for $2.99 each. So we have this one, which is a flock party, which as you can see is kind of berry and gold toned. Then we have this one, which is Stop Ruffling My Feathers, which is kind of more coppery um, and brownie toned, I would say. And then lastly, we have Hosta, Hosta La Costa Baby, which is a uh, blue and uh, purpley toned one. And they're all pretty beautiful. Um, I think I'm just gonna pick one and try and use it for a look. I'm not gonna swatch them uh, just cause, I don't know. But I'll just pick one and do a look and I'll be right back to let you guys know how it went.
So here is the eyeshadow look. I primarily used um, Flock Party. Um, honestly, the eyeshadows are okay. Um, I mean, they're fine, they're wet and wild, so they're not gonna be like the most pigmented, but they're okay, so there you go. All right, so next on to the eyeliners, and these are, I mean, these are the colors. You get a gold and a green. So the gold is a metallic, and the green is just a regular liquid liner. And these retail for, let's see, these retail for $2.99 each, and there's also a third color um, that's not in here, which I think is like a pink color. So this gold one is called Gilded Wings, and then the green one is called Winged and Wild. And I think I'm gonna use the green on my, uh, to do like a wing, and then probably maybe the gold on like my lower lash line or in my inner corner just to add a little bit of sparkle. So I'm gonna go off and do that now. And I don't know if I said these retail for $2.99 each. Yeah, I think I said that. So we're just gonna go and see how they look. All right, so the eyeliners are on my face, and I have to say I really, really like these. These are so much better than the Gothographic liners. Um, they're not chunky, they're really pigmented, and I will use these in the future. So that's really, really awesome. We're gonna move on now to the baked blushes. Now you can also use these as highlights because they are very shimmery blushes. So I'm probably gonna use one as a blush and one as a highlight. So you have three here and they retail for $4.99 each. You have Don't Flutter Yourself, which is a light pink color. Then we have Hummingbird A Hype, which is kind of like a peachy color. And then last, Dare to Soar, which is a berry color. I think I'm gonna go in with Ugh. I think I'm gonna go in with Dare to Soar as a blush, and then probably either Hummingbird Hype or Don't Flutter Yourself as a uh, highlight color. So let me let me zoom you out a little bit, angle you down. Imagine. There we go. We're just gonna take this on one of my blush brushes. I don't really wear blush that often, but. I don't know, we'll have to see. Ooh, wow, oh, I might have put on. <laughs> I might have done that thing where I put on too much. Let's see if we can blend it out. Very blushy look today. Yeah, that's really pretty. Just ignore the fact that I put on way too much. Try the other side. That's a little better. Maybe a bit too much. I might have put on too much. But I do really like it. Let me just blush up my nose a little. I like it. I think I put on too much, but it's really pretty. So I think for highlight, I'm gonna try out Hummingbird Hype and hopefully maybe even lighten this up a little bit. This is almost like a nectarish color. I don't know how to describe it. It's peachy. It's really pretty. This is a great highlight. <laughs> Look at that glow. Yeah, that's, that's beautiful. So I just took my hair out of the headband. Um, I I really like these. I really like these. Um, I'm excited to like keep trying them um, because I think they're fantastic. I think these are great, and you can use them as blush and you can use them as highlight, which is great. Last up, we have the four lip glosses right here. Now, if you know me, you know I'm not a really big fan of lip gloss. Uh, because I find them sometimes to be very sticky, but hopefully these aren't like the sticky type, but let's just see. I think I'm gonna swatch them on the back of my hand and then choose one to 
try and you know complete this look so this one is the first one is called featherless and it's like a light pink peachy nude gloss so here is what it looks like very subtle packaging is adorable too they have like hummingbirds and leaves on the top and the next color we have is fly gal which is kind of like a light pink can't really see there you go next we have pout of paradise which is like a burnt orange almost which is really pretty oh yeah that's what that looks like and then the last color is shut the pluck up which is a almost purpley toned berry color oh yeah that's nice so that's what that looks like i think this is actually the one i'm gonna go with so shut the pluck up let's try it on the lips So these aren't sticky, which is great. Um, these feel really nice and like nourishing on the lips, or this one at least does. The others feel kind of the same. Um, I really like this. I really like these. Oh, by the way, these retail for $3.99 each, the lip glosses. So overall, the only thing that I really wouldn't really use again is the eyeshadow palettes. Everything else I really enjoyed. Um, I mean, yeah, uh, final look looks pretty good. <laughs> anyway, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I mean, I enjoyed this, this, this is great. I love this collection and I love the fact that it's hummingbird themed because I love hummingbird. So that was the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to give it a big a thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button down below, become a member of the Beautiful Dreamer family. Click that little bell icon to get my notifications. All the products, well, I mean, I don't have that much on my face, but all the products will be listed down in the description box below as well as my social medias. Um, and I think that's pretty much it. I will see you guys in my next video. Stay beautiful. Bye.